guys, welcome back to another video showcasing new things on Dinosaur World Mobile. Today is actually our second double video where we have... Actually, no, this is a quadruple video. Or if that's four. Because upwards, upwards of this bit, we actually have a vote area, which is game mode ecosystems, which is above the game modes bit here, where you have legacy mode. And the Holocene Mobile, which, even though it's its own separate game, I'll show you. See? Holocene, it's right there. Don't ask me why. Anyways, it's rare. I don't know why, but you should vote yes on it. I'm not, you don't have to. You don't, honestly, you don't have to. It would be nice if you could, because it will add multiple maps to there, each with its own called ecosystem thing. And when it says it will add multiple maps, this could mean one thing. This can mean something which might happen. We could get the OG map back. You may be saying, but try charge or what about the OG map of game modes? No, the map where Acrocanthosaurus was I did and where it was OP. That map. We could get that in game modes. I'm not saying we can, but we might. And the other updated thing is on game modes, if we go here, legacy mode, they've actually added the mesh dinosaurs. They've added four of the mesh dinosaurs. Oh. I'll move this backwards so you guys can get a better view. Done. Okay, so we will know this loading screen if you've played Legacy Mode before. Let's see. Select an option. If you look to the left, we have all of these. But look here. The Mesh Era has something there. Oh. I thought this was actually going to be the old Megrosaur. Anyways, we have the old Stegosaur there. And if you remember, the old Stegosaur was just amazing. We have the OG map in the background, which was the map I was talking about. We have the um, Albertosaur and Lymphorax. With the Mesh Era, the thing that they did best on is was for carnivores and stegosaur here it's sad how in the it's still sad how in the brick era we haven't gotten triceratops yet sorry about that it got delayed for a bit <sighs> anyways it's only free so i'm hoping we get the brick triceratops back as that would actually be amazing Okay, oh, just a little bit here. I don't know if you guys could see that. But here, it sadly, doesn't show the brick map. Probably because it re stretched across two maps. Anyways, there's one gap left. So I really hope that one will be the brick triceratops. As we actually didn't get that on the main game where it says group dinosaurs. It was the only ceratopsid where we didn't get the brick model of. Yeah, we still got the brick styracosaur here. Now, the Tetherados and the Allosaurus are here, which is amazing. I haven't done that. I, I actually haven't done a video on legacy mode. So after this, I'll do a separate video on that. But... As you can see, they've added them. I'll do a separate video on these guys. Anyways, if we just go back to Dinosaur World Mobile. Yes, that is a way to go back. We will actually, no, we will actually, I will now look at the new updates. All right. So... The total yes votes are 90, more than 19,000. So it looks like we may get the OG map back. So let's see. It's on Herb for 1 and Herb for 2. On Herb for 2, we actually have an updated Giraffe Titan. And on Herb for 1, we have an updated Styracosaur. Now, it showed this on the game menu before we got added. So I just joined Dinosaur World Mobile every single day. And it wasn't there. 
I'll move the camera back so you can see. I say this is the best view we can get. Okay, so here we basically can see the whole screen, you know. But we see in the background there, you know, we've got a new Stego model which is really quite good. Wait, because it kind of looks pretty fat. The new Pento model actually kind of looks a bit small and its tail is tiny. Anyways, if we go to Giraffe of Titan and we click on it, we can spawn it in planes. Random spawn will spawn you in wetlands. Planes will just, yeah, spawn you in planes. So if we click on that, we have the lovely loading screen. They haven't updated the loading screen to the new Giraffe of Titan model yet. But here we have it. The new Giraffe of Titan. This thing is absolutely massive. As you can see. Let's zoom in to this. Oh. Here we have the head. I can see the thing they've worked on best is the body, neck and head. Feet haven't really improved that much. Looks like I got a bad spawn, but I can get out of it. <sighs> I'll try to go over there. Okay? Three, two, one. Go! Anyways... We can see the giraffe of Titan a bit more clearly now. We can see its beautiful head. Uh, 